Jumping center Nick Thielen against Mark Williams, and the tap is won by Duke. First game for Bellamy. Dump down, Hurts. That's one of those big keys I'm talking about, Eric. Because of the pandemic. Still looking for their first shot. And blocked away. Mark Williams with the block. Found money. Up and in. Basket Dylan Penn. And now on the other end, the big man. Inside out. Lane opens up for Stewart. Score the goal. Good nice. Chicago kid, DJ Stewart. Seven footer. You've got to be able to get the ball over the top of his outstretched hands. But that's the last play right there. After the ball goes inside to Williams. Bradshaw. Hounded by Moore. Again, wonderful defense play by Mark Williams. Finds Brakefield. And now Stewart works the baseline. Lefty jumper Brakefield. Swirls it through. It's a quick shot, but it's a good shot. Roach Brakefield. Brakefield off the pine, looking good. For shots that they normally make, and we're missing them right now at point blank range. Brakefield! He's made three out of three from behind. Get a lot of defensive pressure on the perimeter. Backdoor cuts are available. Thielen crawls it over the front of the iron. Nick Thielen, his first deuce. Trying to post up Williams. Stewart. Wow! Look at Mark Williams. The tap, the score, and the foul. On the floor for Bellman. Hurt, quick trigger. Rattled it through. Matthew Hurt, his first three-pointer of the ball game. Now 10 on the block to dump down. Bradshaw twirling through the air. Very nice. Those are the backdoor cuts that are available. Jamin Brakefield back into the game for Duke. Score the goal. Alex Freem. Hurt step back three. Oh, oh I didn't see that coming. I did not see that coming. Now Bradshaw goes one-on-one -on -one against Hurt. Hurt did a good job of staying in front. I like this kid. Sam DeVault rips a triple. Hurt had the ball poked away. This is Tappé. Score it. And he's fouled. Claycomb. And a cut and a score. Good job by Bash Whelan. Penn offensive rebound. Claycomb. Ethan Claycomb, he's another Division I transfer, came in from Indiana State. And also a decent rebounder from the guard position. Here's Bradshaw. Sneaks inside, scored, and he's fouled. Joining the Division I ranks, they're actually not eligible for postseason play. Paul High with some force, Nick Phelan, scoring, and he's fouled. In the corner, Penn. Shot clock's at five. Feel it. And all of a sudden, it's a five-point game. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> but they also win every year. Claycomb with the left hand. Spins it through. Ethan Claycomb. Stewart. Extra pass more. Hurt. Oh, that helps. That helps. It's a long two, but it's a bucket Duke needed. More. Tap out by Williams. Good job. Goldwire. Bottom of the well. Senior Jordan Goldwire. Leaves it for Penn. Ball stolen away by Stewart. And Moore all of a sudden has come alive. Live ball turnover typically. Dylan Penn. Step back. That's a great sign for the Knights. I like the way he used the dribble. Bradshaw spins, blocked away by Williams. You've got to know when you make that pivot and turn, Williams is going to be there. He's their last line of defense, and he's coming over to help. Hurt. Matthew Hurt, sophomore from Rochester, Minnesota. Offensive rebound, Williams gets rewarded. Good stick to it in this, Mark Williams. Right idea, got close to the basket. Oh, wow. Transition triple hurts. Fourth three-pointer of the night. He is feeling it. Whelan. And 
Bradshaw scores a contested layup. Edmund much better today. Just one for seven from the field. Goldwire. Wow. Parting of the seas. Penn flying from one end to the other. Bats rings the bell. That'll help. Secondary transition basket that time. Good set up by the penetration. The easy kick out for the jumper. Lefty three. Breakfields hit four of them. Jamin Brakefield. No look pass to Bradshaw. Again, no look pass this time to Vault. Blocked away by Hurt. Duke the lead of 16 and the ball. Brakefield had a clean look. Hurt clears himself. Bottom of the well. Too easy. This guy is fun to watch. Talking about Matthew Hurt. Long drive. There's Williams, though. Yeah. Williams changes everything. Nice. Ethan Claycomb, senior from Vincennes, Indiana. It's a nice rebound from that Michigan State game that saw them go just 5 of 23 from distance. Baker, that's the 11th three-pointer for Duke. And just 8th two-point field goal. Claycomb, continuation, score the goal, chance for a three-point play. Ball loose, and Johnson picks up the loose ball. Here comes Stewart. Hurt. Wow, good strength. We were told he added 25 pounds in the offseason. There you go. First bucket of the game, Jalen Johnson. And the steal. Stewart, what do you got? Oh my! Didn't expect that. DJ Stewart, how do you do? Entire game. And the one time he gets up is after his player dunk. He can bounce. He made the pass to Matthew Hurt on the fire possession. Claycomb. Ball grounds of Chicago, Illinois. D.J. Stewart is the latest and greatest. Finally, something goes in deep for Jalen Johnson. Good pass. Beautiful pass. That finds Thielen to impact the game. Bellman was uh, very good for many, many years at the Division II level. And all of a sudden, seven quickies for Jalen Johnson. Now playing in the ace sun for the first time. Again, beautiful pass. Finds Thielen underneath. And he scores the goal. Duke, the basketball and the ball. And the lead up by 20. Hurt's been a huge story. And again! They still continuing to write that story. He's doing this as a sophomore. Just imagine if he stays as a senior where his development will be thinking. As, a, as, a, a, as, a, as a shooter. Just imagine. <laughs> Old wire setting up the offense. Stewart. Jump stop. Backdoor cut. Johnson! Oh, that's the future right there. Stewart to Johnson for a pair. That type of movement. Henry Coleman into the game for Duke. This is Penn. Reverse layup. I thought that sounded familiar. Here's Coleman. Stronger than 10 rows of onions. Look at that guy. No foot fancy. Thielen slides in, score the goal, and a foul. Nick Thielen's been an eye opener. He's committed at least one turnover. Locked away. Patrick Tappé uh, in the A Sun. So it's a way to cut down on travel. It's a way to hopefully you know, get the games in in the order that they should be played. So we'll see how that works for Bellarmin and the A-Sun. That is certainly a feather in the cap to both coaches and how they run their program. I've been impressed with Coleman's anticipation. That's his second steal. This time, he finishes with two hands. Coleman, the cooler, puts this game on ice. <laughs> and another steal. And they forgot to stop the ball. Roach, finger roll, crawls it over the front of the iron with a two games up and one game down. Next up for the Duke Blue Devils will be Tuesday against another Big Ten team. They will take on Illinois. There's your final score. Duke 76, Bellman 54.